Hey guys! Welcome back to my YouTube channel today I'm going to share a this Z-score probability indicator, high winning trading strategy. Most accurate trading view indicators with price action, in today's video we're going to be discussing price action with powerful indicators that can help you avoid false entries in trading. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced trader, these indicators are sure to help you improve your trading performance. So sit back relax and get ready to discover the secrets of successful trading with the help of these magic indicators with price action. This method works for forex cryptocurrency stocks and any other market that has a high level of liquidity, it shows excellent results on shorter time frames such as 1 minute 5 minutes and 15 minute. Traders before we start be sure to click the like button on this video. And subscribe to Secret Strategies. Our mission with this channel is to turn you into a successful trader as fast as possible so how can we build this indicator setup? On this day we are going to see a strategy with relative ND and scalping extremely easy with which you can obtain very fast and profitable results. I am sure that when you see how this strategy works you will realize that the buy and sell advance decline gives us an incredible advantage. We decided to give back to the community and share the secret strategy with you for free, so that you can make good and consistent profits from trading. We will try not to make the video too long. We hope that you will definitely like this strategy video. First of all let us know about trading tools. The long and short signal indicator we see in the chart is called the relative Andean scalping indicator. The indicator is bottom green and red area, we call it the MACD cross tactic indicator. Now we tell you how we want to trade. Let's start the video. We open the TSAL 5 minute chart. This strategy works well on the 5 minute time frame, as this strategy is unique as no one has ever told you about it before. Let us know understand trading setup. First of all, we will search relative ND and scalping indicator in the search box of trading view. After that we have to click on relative ND and scalping option. In which we have to change some setting. We have to change this ND and agonal length option from 13 to 27. After that we have to apply another indicator on the chart. We will search awesome oscillator and MACD cross tactic in the search box of trading view. After that we have to click on awesome oscillator and MACD cross tactic option. In which we have to change some setting. We have to change this rapid area size based on AO length periods option from 21 to 20. We have to keep these awesome oscillator options hide. Now our setup is ready. If you get to learn something new on our channel, then do subscribe to our YouTube channel. Let's see how we use these trading setups. When the relative ND and indicator gives us a sell signal. When the MACD cross tactic indicator should be MACD bearish cross signal. When the MACD cross tactic indicator should be MACD histogram red area. When the market forms a bearish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place sell order. Our stop loss is to be placed at the previous high of the market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. I hope you must have understood this trading strategy. Let us now understand the long position. When the relative ND and indicator gives us a buy signal. When the MACD cross tactic indicator should be MACD bullish cross signal. When the MACD cross tactic indicator should be MACD histogram green area. When the market forms a bullish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place by order. Our stop loss is to be placed at the previous low of the market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. I hope you must have liked this trading setup and strategy. If not, then it doesn't matter, we are going to see examples of some trades, so that you will definitely understand. 
Here the relative Andean indicator gives us a cell signal. Here the MACT cross tactic indicator MACT bearish cross signal. Here the MACT cross tactic indicator MACT histogram red area. Here market has made a bearish candle to give confirmation. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are placing an order to sell. Our stop loss is to be placed at the previous high of the market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. We have got the signal. Here the relative Andean indicator gives us a sell signal. Here the MACD cross tactic indicator MACD bearish cross signal. Here the MACD cross tactic indicator MACD histogram red area. Here market has made a bearish candle to give confirmation. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are placing an order to sell. Our stop loss is to be placed at the previous high of the market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. Here we have got the next signal. Close this trade. Here the relative Andean indicator gives us a buy signal. Here the MACD cross tactic indicator MACD bullish cross signal. Here the MACD cross tactic indicator MACD histogram green area. Here market has made a bullish candle to give confirmation. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are placing an order to buy. Our stop loss is to be placed at the previous low of the market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. We have got the signal. Here the relative Andean indicator gives us a sell signal. Here the MACD cross tactic indicator MACD bearish cross signal. Here the MACD cross tactic indicator MACD histogram red area. Here market has made a bearish candle to give confirmation. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are placing an order to sell. Our stop loss is to be placed at the previous high of the market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. I hope you must have liked this trading strategy. If you are new to our YouTube channel then please subscribe our channel. Thank you for watching our video. See you in the next video.